Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. I just got home from work. I'm so exhausted today for some reason. I'm going away for this upcoming weekend. It's my birthday weekend. My birthday's on Sunday. It's a long weekend here in Canada, so I'm going away to my cottage and there's not, ooh, bug in my face. There's not gonna be a video on Sunday, but since I'm going away, I was like, oh, I need to film something. I haven't filmed anything for Friday or Sunday. I should do at least one video. But all I really feel like filming right now is like a cozy kind of nonsense vlog. No lists, no stuff like that that I, I do. I feel like I've been doing a lot of those lately and I'm just kind of like over it for the moment. What I'm gonna film today basically is I want to address what's actually going on in my house right now. So in my background, in the rest of my house. If you've been watching my videos up until like two weeks ago, I've got these black shelves behind me and normally they're filled to the brim with books and then lately they've been this, just full of random crap. And as mentioned before, it's because I'm building a library in a different part of my house. So I'm gonna give you a little sneak peek on what that looks like. I'm not gonna reveal the whole thing because I do wanna do like a reveal video. I think that'd be fun. So today let's just like walk around my house a bit and take a look at what I've got going on. My neighbor just like dropped a bunch of glass outside, it sounds like. Hope they're okay. Put, let's put you to this. Okay, so I'm just gonna take the camera. This is truly the most chaotic video. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe and ring the bell icon. So yeah, now empty shelves, the bottoms are still Bullish because I am moving things down as the shelves are built and the shelves are like 25% built so I still have a long way to go. My whole series shelf is still together but in total disarray because I've just been not bothering to put stuff back correctly. Classic shelves still going strong except for the display on top has moved downstairs. Oh god I just kicked a pile of books on the floor. I'm a dang mess. There's some random stuff over here that will end up going downstairs eventually. I'm not gonna show you my diplomas because they've got all my like real name and stuff, but I've got some signed maps, a signed thing from Ryan Cahill. He said to Juliana, AKA Canada girl. Cause he never really learned my name when I met him. More books on the floor that are waiting to go downstairs. <laughs> Okay, let's go downstairs. <gasps> hi. Hello. Would you like to say hi, Jones? Where are you going? What if we just take a break part way down? What if we just take a break part way downstairs to hang out with Jones? How would you guys feel about that? Hey, come here. Oh God, she left. Jones, come here. Come here. Hi. Oh God. Thank you, ma'am. It's my baby. My baby. I should really keep doing the video, but I just want to hang out with Jones. <sighs> no, I really can't get up. Okay. Maybe this is just the end of the video now. <laughs> Let's go downstairs. Come with me, Joe. I'm hoping we're gonna see some more animals in this trip. You can come with me, Joe. You don't have to stay upstairs. Whatever. I found another pet. Hold on. Hi, Danny. He's not supposed to be on the sun deck, but I left the door open and he takes advantage of it. You a good boy? She's following, but very slowly. Okay, we're almost in the right spot. The room is 25% done, as I've mentioned. It's, it's not there yet, but right now I've got my board game shelf set up. That's gonna completely change. That's gonna become 
books. <laughs> the board games are gonna go in the dining room. I was watching Bob's Burgers before filming, as I always do. You might think I'm exaggerating, but Bob's Burgers is something I watch every day. I don't really watch it every day, but it's always on in my house. It's my comfort show, and I'm so used to it that I actually have it on while I'm reading, so it's my background noise while I'm reading books, because I'm a psychopath. Books on the floor. Secondary tripod. The white shelves are what I've actually been working on. Like this is what I have built. The brown shelves were upstairs, but when they became empty because the books that were on it went up there, I brought the brown shelves down just as a temporary solution. Don't look at those. <laughs> for books. But the plan is to build white shelves all the way across here, behind the TV, up these walls, and across there, and if need be, above the windows as well. This bean bag belongs to Jones. It's indented like that because usually she's lying on it. I still have to put the white iron-on strips on the outsides of some of the wood pieces so that they look like this. So that and that stuff needs it. I'll get there. Going slow. Honestly, we're just winging building this. So it's not in like the greatest shape, but I think we're doing a pretty good job. I don't like these buns that I did. Oh. <laughs> I know my mom's gonna watch this video and then she's gonna be really mad if I point this out, but when we moved into the house, we realized that these stained glass windows are penises. You're on a tripod now. I picked up Mary by Nat Cassidy today which is exciting for me, except for the fact that her last name starts with CA, so she has to go up on the shelf, which means I have to move probably every single book. So I'm gonna do that right now, because I feel like it. Okay, remember how I said I was really tired? <laughs> I just don't even wanna deal with that right now. So I'm not... <laughs> I'm not gonna fix that. I just kind of piled some books in random places. Don't talk about it. Don't look at me. I don't know when the next set of shelves will get built. It's sort of like, as I can afford shelves, we buy the wood, and that's that. So eventually, when I get my act together, my background will be these shelves instead of the black ones upstairs. Hopefully that will be soon-ish. It honestly could already be now, I just have not wanted to showcase unfinished shelves but part of the reason i'm doing this vlog today is because i just feel like i haven't been myself lately i feel kind of meh i feel like i'm sort of forcing content a bit and i i don't know i just wanted to feel more like me again and i was in a weird limbo of like not having a space to film because i was like embarrassed of the chaos shelves upstairs which is silly and i'm like also embarrassed of the unfinished shelves down here so i just don't feel like i've been as collected and on in my videos lately which is dumb <laughs> so i am doing see i told you that's her spot and like all i can think about right now is the fact that my lighting is garbage that's all i can think about and i'm not in focus <laughs> but Jones is in focus and that's all that really matters. Bringing the books into the heart of our home was very important to me. And when I had all my books up in my office upstairs, it felt very like sequestered from the rest of the house. It felt like this, this thing that is the biggest part of my personality was hidden away from our life. But my husband is a huge nerd as well and we have a pretty decent sized house and a lot of space for books. So it's really exciting to be moving my, my big passion into a main room in our home to showcase to people that come over and so that I can sit here on the couch and watch Bob's Burgers and look at my books and just feel surrounded by things that make me happy. There's one right there. <laughs> I 
hope you guys like this video. I don't know what it's gonna even cut down to look like. I've just been filming myself walking around the house and it's really strange. But this is me, this is my life. Very strange and not put together and embarrassing. Anyways, thank you for being here and listening to me ramble and rant. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for sticking around. Before I go, don't forget to like and subscribe and ring the bell icon so you know when I upload new videos. I upload three days a week. I am not uploading on Sunday because I'm away at my cottage for my birthday, but I will be back on Tuesday. I love you guys, goodbye.